a former Boeing employee known for raising concerns about the firm's production standards, has been found dead in the U.S. John Barnett worked for Boeing for more than 30 years before retiring in 2017. In the days before his death, he had been giving evidence in a whistleblower lawsuit against the company. Boeing said it was saddened to hear of Mr. Barnett's passing. The Charleston County coroner confirmed his death to the BBC on Monday. It said the 62-year-old had died from a self-inflicted wound on 9th of March and police were investigating. In 2019, Mr. Barnett told the BBC that under-pressure workers had been deliberately fitting substandard parts to aircraft on the production line. He also said he had uncovered serious problems with oxygen systems, which could mean one in four breathing masks would not work in an emergency. He said soon after starting work in South Carolina, he had become concerned that the push to get new aircraft built meant the assembly process was rushed and safety was compromised, something the company denied. He later told the BBC that workers had failed to follow procedures intended to track components through the factory, allowing defective components to go missing. He said in some cases, substandard parts had even been removed from scrap bins and fitted to planes that were being built to prevent delays on the production line. He also claimed that tests on emergency oxygen systems due to be fitted to the 787 showed a failure rate of 25%, meaning that one in four could fail to deploy in a real-life emergency. Mr. Barnett said he had alerted managers to his concerns, but no action had been taken 